get it myself. But it means one of those two things, the diamond-like tradition, adamantine, solid, or the, the lightning-like, like, like a lightning bolt. Uh, also known as tantra, um, and in Japan I'm known as mikyo, as, uh, which is esoteric Buddhist homes, and trying to convince them to become homeless like we were. And then at some point the Buddha figured out that this was a little hard for some of us, and so he established monasticism, and then monasticism became the preeminent Buddhist vehicle for uh, until we came along, so it's about 1800 of uh, having people like myself who do specialized training and then for, therefore are able to receive um, donations and salaries, but who really fundamentally are not any different from anybody else. You know, I, uh, Brenda, I've gone through the ministerial assistant training program. You have to have been a member of the temple for three years and then there's a three-year training program and then we uh, can have you certified. And uh, that's the, the prime place to draw professional ministers from. That way of thinking is changing, and so I'm encouraging all my friends who are in, involved in the Minister Assistant Program, move ahead quickly if you have any thought of becoming, becoming less uh, popular in our group. Um, the, the, uh, we uh, spoke, I, I gave you the uh, little graph chart last week, uh, and you, know, you always hear about the Eightfold Path and the Four Noble Truths, but the Eightfold Path is simply one way of explaining the three, three learnings or three behaviors of uh, wholesome conduct, what's usually called meditation, and uh, wisdom. Uh, meditation is used to group together a whole bunch of different uh, East Asian and South Asian terms. Um, and also the objective is not so very clear. Uh, in, again, the, the Theravada seems to be concerned with meditation as a way of uh, overcoming the past.